Okay, okay, okay. You know, originally I wasn't gonna make a video this week because I was stuck in I was stuck in the flood in Brisbane, but um now I'm sort of being forced into making this video. Why you may ask? Well, Chelsea, my favorite football team, is being sold. The owner of the team currently is Roman Abramovich, who is a Russian national and is considered to be a good friend of Vladimir Putin. And well, because of Putin and Zelensky's small beef, um yeah, everyone else is in danger. Especially my club. Chelsea. To be honest with you, I don't even know what to say. Like, what are they doing? Look, what are they doing? Russia, what do you think you're gonna get if you invade Ukraine? Huh? You just, you're just gonna get another country. Then what? You wanna rule the world? You're starting to start, you're just starting another world war. What are you, the new Nazis? Bloody hell. Um, but anyway, anyways, um, let's talk about Biden for a second, huh? Um, Joe Biden, what a good job he's doing, isn't he, huh? Helping Ukraine quite a lot by sanctioning Russia rather than actually doing anything else. What are the sanctions going to do? What are the sanctions going to do? Basically, it's just one bully saying to the other bully, look mate, I won't be coming to your house. I won't be having dinner at your place. I'll be having dinner at mine. You can do whatever you want, but just don't involve me in it. That's basically what the US is saying to Russia. And also now, because of that, China might just invade Taiwan and well, who cares, right? Who cares? USA doesn't care. As long as it doesn't affect them, it doesn't. They don't care. I, I, do, I don't even know what to say about Biden. Really, I don't know what to say. Like Biden, mate. This, this is basically what you said. I said we don't have the capacity. <laughs> Zelensky is actually a hero right now because he's he's fighting the war himself, and the amount of effort he's putting in. Like I don't think any president. I don't think Joe Biden, Trump. Boris Johnson? That's his name, I think. Yeah. Boris Johnson, yeah. So I don't think any of them would put in as much effort as he's putting in if their country was invaded. And now, Zelensky, just for you, mate. <laughs> but for the rest of you guys, what a poor job you're doing. What a poor job. Now, ScoMo, you're old, mate. You, I don't think you would have done anything good. But on, on, but honestly, like, I just don't understand like Zelensky and Putin. Why are you guys fighting? Why are you guys fighting? Putin, if you just want the land, it's better ways to resolve. Like, why Why do you want land in the first place? Huh? What are you going to do? Huh? What are you going to do? You're going to boost the economy by destroying your own economy and destroying like half of Russia. Yeah, you, you've already got the most land in the world. And why do you want more? Why do you want the world? Just tell me this. Yeah. I know, like, people People might watch, like, what? I know, like, 10. Oh, wait. How many viewers do I have right now? About 30-ish? Yeah, I think... I think about 20 or 30 people would watch it, but I just don't understand why Putin, you want, you want Ukraine, like, what are you going to get from invading Ukraine, huh? You just, you've destroyed your economy, you've destroyed everything else, basically, like, a anything related to Russia, you've destroyed. My, my favourite club, Chelsea, has gone for sale, that's the worst part of it all. Yeah, Roman Abramovich, great owner, great, great football club owner, like, he, I don't know, since his edition, I don't know how many trophies Chelsea's won, but like, was it like back in 2000, 2002, somewhere around there, right? That's when, that's when he bought the team, and then since then, I, I think he bought for like about 150 million. I don't know if it's dollars or pounds, but it's like 150 million something. And now it's Chelsea's being Chelsea's going on sale for three billion. You know, that's what. Let me let me do the maths. Um, that's about two thousand percent increase in the value if i'm not wrong that's a lot that's a lot honestly mate putin just end the war and don't let chelsea go and say please please what are you like zelensky and you are fighting like animals be civilized okay don't fight just talk just talk it out just talk it out just meet with each other and just talk it out why do you have to fight why do you have to fight huh like what's it what's it gonna achieve you what What's fighting gonna achieve? If anything, you're just gonna people are gonna lose their lives, their jobs, their houses. They're gonna lose everything. Whilst you guys are just sitting in the back of your office, not caring about what happens to these people, and it's got you guys just want to fight. Especially you, especially you, and Biden. Mate, what are you doing? What are you doing? Like you just you you're just sitting back and saying, "Oh, Russia, you can do whatever you want. Um, we won't really we won't do anything to you. We, won't, we don't care. Why you may ask? Well, it doesn't affect us. Yeah." Just, Stop the wall, please. Please just stop the wall. 
Yeah, I'm also I'm also a bit irritated because of the floods because there wasn't any electricity here for the past four days and now I've sort of been forced into making this video because Chelsea's going on sale and I don't want it to go on sale. So please Biden just end the war, don't let Chelsea go on sale. Thanks for listening to my rant and see you next week.